Well, she's produced an award-winning album, performed with Stan Walker, worked as a television presenter, sung at the opening ceremony for the 2011 Rugby World Cup, I was there for that one, and is now making her first foray into acting with Auckland Live's The Beautiful Ones. It is great to have you with us, Bria Hall. Yay! Yeah, thank you. Thank you, thank you. So how are you finding it? So rehearsals and everything, how's it all going, the whole acting thing? Let me just correct my faux pas that I did earlier, because I know my acting tutors will be like, you forgot. <laughs> Good. It's cardinal sin in acting. So, a kiss. The juxtaposition of the abyss calorus oris muscle in the state of contraction. Wow. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's good. When you say it like that. Yeah. <laughs> and very committed to it too. Which Must I, be. Which I guess an actor has to do. Congratulations yes. on Kilda. everything that, that ha that's happening. Um, tell me a bit more about The Beautiful Ones, because I'm just trying to get my head around what it actually is. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's pretty much just a fusion of various genres of, of the arts. So... Um, there's some wonderful audio visuals, there's incredible music produced by Kay Saba, there is um, live singing, live performance and amazing dance and of course acting, but it's not a musical. Right, right, because that's yeah, what I was yeah. going to say, is it a musical? It's not, no. so it's, not a play, it's not a play, it's not a musical, it's sort of like a... It's, it's just a, a mishmash of awesomeness, let's just put it that way. Oh, good description. <laughs> wow. And so how did you get involved with it? Um, well the director, Hone Koka, he um, approached me about two months ago and I answered him immediately. I was like, hell yeah, I'll give it a go. I mean, why not? And so you had done no acting? Zero acting. I've done a lot of presenting, emceeing, hosting, but never done any acting at all. And so what's your role? Sorry. My role, uh, her name is The Lady and she's like this otherworldly kind of being that comes back to, as it's set in a nightclub, and right. she comes back to the nightclub where she started um, and just assesses the situation and what's going on in the club at, like today, now, and tries to bring love together, these two young lovers together. Sounds intriguing. Yeah, and how have you <laughs> found it? Because I, I would assume that if you are a performer, you're probably quite natural at the acting. Is that what you've found? Um, yeah, I think that's the assumption, but at the same time, you have to work extra hard. Right. You know, um, it's not something that I've ever done before, so I've tried to delve into it as much as I can, and having... Um, Hone and the team there are just, you know, they're, they're just so invaluable to me in this situation and my first foray, foray into well, acting. That's so. the thing, isn't it? When you're, when you're presenting or whatever, you're a version of yourself, maybe yeah, a bit absolutely. more flamboyant, but you yourself, mm -hmm. when you're acting, you have to go and be someone else. Yeah. And I've Weird. tried to find bits of me in the character, and so I've really workshopped her background and made up a backstory so that I was able to easily to transition much more easier into the role. So you're acting and singing? Yes, yes, so thank goodness, because, you know, singing is something that comes a lot more easier than acting does, but, um, yes, there's, yeah, I'm singing a few times in the show. Nice, and speaking of your singing, mm -hmm. what have you been working on? Because I hear there could be a new single coming out yes, very soon. Yes, th there is a new single coming out, which is fantastic, um, and I actually performed the single in the show. Oh, that's convenient. <laughs> Isn't it just? <laughs> you have to, are you holding your new album as well, going by this? <laughs> well, the album's not entirely finished, but it's in the processes now. And um, it just it was serendipitous that it all happened at this time. You know, myself and my record label, Loop, Aotearoa, had planned to release a single on this date some time back, and the show ends up being the same week. And the story is about love, and my song is about an intrinsic love within yourself, and finding love for you um, in times of darkness and it just perfect perfect yeah the thing also about the show is that uh Hone put it on last year with uh, all yes. of the performers so you're the newbie who really you've really come into it on some so the feel? newbie <laughs> i'm so the newbie um and i actually came in a week a week um after they had started oh, like rehearsing you started school late yeah i started harder. school so late and um no it was it was wonderful i mean the team are very young and extremely fresh and vibrant and um, just have so much to offer and I'm so excited for people to see them you know I'm so excited for people to see young fresh new talent that are coming through yeah. and um, this is the perfect forum for them as well not just myself you know it's a it's a team effort and um, I just really have to give props to them and you know they really looked they really looked after me really really well during rehearsals so bless. Well speaking of being looked after I know you're part of the Mali All-Stars which is coming yes. up. Yes. Uh, Jason Kerrison and Shelton were here yesterday describing that for us which was fascinating. Yeah. Did you pick your own song? Yes I did. I picked my own songs yes I did. Or can you tell us what ones you're doing? Can Are you, you remember? Do you want to yeah, 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 know? Give us this bell. Okay so um, I am performing Natural Mystic. Um, and I'm performing Zion Trains, Zion Trains off 
um, the Uprising album, and then Fran, Korta and I are doing Redemption Song together. <gasps> oh, that's my favourite. Yeah. Redemption Song, absolutely love it. Oh, we've got to be excited then. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. No, we love it. That's so cool. Yeah. Um, so what, after this, you do the, you do the show, mm -hmm. then what is next for you? So I do the show, I release the single on the 24th of November. Yeah. Um, which is a Thursday, and then I pretty much have a few days off and then go straight into rehearsals for the Marley the show. Stars, yeah. The All Stars show. No rest, no rest, no for, rest for the wicked. Well, on your well, it's been an absolute pleasure having you in the studio Your with Rhea Hall. We'll be on stage with the beautiful ones from this Saturday at Auckland's Aotea Centre. Tickets are available from Ticketmaster. Rhea, thank you so much. Thank you, guys. Kia ora. Yeah, best of luck.